Ooh, 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 ooh. We are back in it today with some more Rise of Ronin. So recently, Wukong has come out. So that's the big gripe. In it. I mean, the big thing that everybody's playing right now is Wukong. And I think the game looks fabulous. And I think it's fabulous as well for the world and the gaming community and stuff. Why so? Because it's forcing, not really necessarily forcing people, but it's encouraging people to learn more about another culture. Wukong comes from China. And it's a folklore that dates back way, way, way back. So some people that are very interested in the game are like, oh, let me find out the lore behind this as well. So they're starting to read Journey to the West and stuff like that and actually learn about Wukong and learn about some of the folklore that happens with that. And I believe that is awesome for China and the Chinese studio that produced produced this game and whatnot. So it, it can go far away. And this is still, this is one of the reasons why I said before that the Korean studio that produced uh, Liza P., in my mind, missed the mark because they could have easily made a Korean based like Dark Souls game that was more so focuses on, on Korean history, but in a Dark Souls S Souls like gameplay, basically. So that way the world can learn some more about Korea, because I my, myself, I have learned a lot about history and stuff because of video games. Samurai Warriors and Dynasty Warriors have taught me a lot about history. Although it's depicted in a fictional way with the combat, it actually goes back and talks about the actual history of like some of the battles and stuff that happened. So it made me learn about Japan. It made me learn about China. Now, there is no Korean Warriors game, which I don't know why they should bring one in so, that we, can, so we can learn about that way. But there, there isn't. <clears throat> there was, I would be learning about it. And I... Uh, but they, they definitely should, man. They should, they should, they should take that advice and take this because Wukong had like two million people playing it the first day. So they should take that and use this building block, and they should make their own game and stuff off of that based on their history. And we should, we'll be able to learn some stuff from it. But let's go ahead and get with this. That's what we're supposed to be doing today. Ah, there you are. What's the matter? I used to come here all the time. But the last time I came, things didn't quite go as planned. Mm. If only it were something like that. What I'm saying is, I can't face going in there today. Why don't we take care of something else first? Oh my gosh, Ryoma just be on some stuff, bro. Ah, all right, all right. Anything to help forge a new Japan. So I did some some uh, side quests, and one of the side quests I did had Izo in it. If you remember, Izo's the he's the the uh, white haired dude with the dual swords that always seemed like he was always on edge and like he was always ready to kill some stuff. Like he just wasn't with everything. And that's exactly what it was. We had we did a quest in which Izo was supposed to be protecting. He's supposed to be Katsu's bodyguard. Oh my gosh, I can't get in there. There's a chest in there. He's Katsu's bodyguard, and we go. And Izu betrays Katsu and wants to fight us and stuff like that. And uh, Katsu's like, yeah, I knew that was going to happen. And, and they basically like, why didn't you tell us? He's like, because I didn't want to hint at y'all that it was happening. And then he runs away or something like that. Case may be. But yeah, he's he now he does. We're working with the Shogunite and he's real against it, even though we're not working with the Shogunite. Katsu is on the Shogunite's team, but he's not really on the Shogunite's team. True. It's good to see you again. I've come to ask a favor, actually. In order to change this country of ours, I'm trying to work out how to reform the Shogunate. And I need the help of skilled swordsmen like you to do it. Mm. Reform the Shogunate, eh? That's certainly a lot to chew on. And give me some time to consider it, will you? Incidentally, the demon bell of Chiba wants to see you. Don't keep her waiting. Huh? Oh, huh? oh Ryoma! Oh, I had hoped no, to see no, you. No, no, no. Oh, you finally 
finally come back to propose, haven't you? Good to see you too, Lady Zana, but uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm just too busy to be thinking about things like that right now. Oh? Are you trying to <laughs> weasel out of your promise? Well, if you're intent on denying me that... Then fight me instead! <laughs> Okay, okay, but you know how I've never been able to stop myself from going easy on you. Uh, well, my friend here is just as strong as me. Why don't you fight them instead? Uh, fight them, you say? And they're always in them because they don't know if I'm a he or a oh, she, so it's always them. You deliver on your promise. I consent. I warn you, I won't lose. Ryoma will be mine. Well, I should lose on purpose for that. Much, but I think you need some privacy. Come. Is Sanachiba, niece of Shusaku, on your guard? Oh, my stamina is gone. I was like, why am I not blocking it? Like, I, got, I was like, I timed that perfect. Yeah, I suck at this. Uh, I suck at the uh, the spark system thing. Like sometimes I can do it, sometimes I can't. Like sometimes I'm, I'm just, just rightfully too slow. Oh my gosh. Giving up? Far from it. Oh. I'm not done yet. They always have so much stamina. Oh, Jesus, I was not expecting that. If you think I'm still a little girl, you're quite mistaken. I'll never give up on you, Dioma. Damn it, that, that last attack keep getting me. What the hell just happened? Okay, thanks. You really helped me out. <clears throat> okay, so now what? Well, let's first of all let's go ahead and hit this. At any moment now, my oven's about to freaking beep like crazy because uh, I'm preheating it so I can bake some cookies. Don't tell me I gotta fight him now, too. Hey, that was some fine work. If you're looking for your mind, Lady Sana, they ran off somewhere. But I'd leave them be for now. Besides, you said something about wanting my help to reform the Shogunate, right? Very well. Beat me, and I'll lend a hand. I knew I was going to fight him. I'm warning you. I won't go easy. Oh. 
So I don't understand how. Ah. Ooh, to where all my stamina were dead. Mm. I, I feel like I feel like that should take away a lot more of his stamina when he's using his attack. Cause, cause first of all, he's, he's using a a great sword, one-handed, by the way. Can I put fire on this? Fire on my wood sword is crazy. Dual wielding great swords is ridiculous. I try, I try to get away of that. I, I knew something dangerous as fuck was coming. Like, I, I try to get out of the way of it. There we go. Done skis. Yeah, once I... I'll speak after this. Lend you my aid. You don't miss a beat, do you? Hot Chiron. What's going on? Looks like a son Oh my gosh, who is this dude? Somewhere. We definitely don't want to fight the old guy. Uh, Master, sorry for disturbing you. I was just sparring with this uh, visitor. I've not seen you before. May I ask why you're here? <laughs> I should have asked her where do you oh, spring from? Dear me. It's time Ryoma reaped what he sowed. He's in for it now. This is Dioma's friend. Said they're going round looking for skilled swordsmen to try and reform the shogunate. And they're dead serious about it, too. Hell, they even strung out me into helping them out. Damn. To think a master like Hachiro could lose. But if you're after good fighters, why not head to the Odani Dojo? Master Odani must be known by just about every swordsman in Edo. He's bound to be a great help. Do come back here whenever you like, though. As a friend of Ryoma, there's no need to be shy. Now let's say this quest gonna make me go get to the Odani place, or if it's just gonna like end there. Oh, nah, I should be ending here. Okay, so the Chibas. All right, I'm gonna see what else we get from this. Cause we should, we should probably get some new fighting styles too. Let me let me let me go ahead and mess. See if I can give him some stuff. Since he's a new friend. Yep. Um, what else do you like? You don't like the training clubs? That's weird. That's, that's, I would definitely have expect him to like training clubs. Let's see what you got to say. What is it? I wouldn't say that. But if you're wondering why I challenged you to a match, it was merely to test your strength. I was curious, after all. Besides... Had Dioma come to me with a measly job that anyone could do, I'd have rejected him. And why not? I'm not at all like those other Ronin you see bumbling about. I don't work for loose change. Alright, that's done with him. Let's find the old man and then the other guy. Well, be seeing you. The old man should be around here somewhere. As someone needs my assistance, so now it's a quest. Chiba, the Chiba chick probably got a quest. Let me see. 
Yep, the Chiba's quest. It's probably it's probably gonna be it's probably gonna have something to do with Ryoma for sure. Training the Chiba Dojo. And that's a quest to train. It's a hidden quest though to train the Chiba Dojo. So I'll take care of that stuff off camera. I don't, I don't do those things on camera because it's just uh it's just it's just busy stuff really. Okay, how am I gonna get up here? Cause I know I can't get around this way or something. There's, there's never a good way to get around. So I gotta find a way up. And then, oh, there we go. Find a way up first, and then you'll find a way around. So over here. Jump down, boom. Gucci, now we got it. Well, now we've made some new friends and we've knocked out one part of the tree part quest. So now we got two more quests than we did. Three blades of an era. We have two quests that just popped up that we need to do that I'm, I'm going to do off camera. And now we still have these two. Uh, a mighty soldier and it hurts to be good to be done. I'm going to knock these two quests off uh, off camera and I'll go from there. Uh, then we have these when that needs to be opened up. I think we have to do this first, probably, and then we'll probably train at the Chiba Dojo. <coughs> Excuse me. But yeah, that's going to be it for this video. We'll probably be right back in a short while with the next video. So I appreciate y'all tagging along. Appreciate y'all always rocking with your boy. I, I, I can't be nothing but blessed for all y'all that, that actually do support me and whatnot. And uh, I'll catch you on the next one.